up guys, Sassy Gangster here, and today I'm going to show you how to download Panda Helper. So Panda Helper is kind of like an app store where you can download uh, paid games that, that cost money, um, hacked games, modded games, and apps, uh, and tweaked games, plus plus apps, and more. So I'm going to show you how to download it for free on iOS, no jailbreak, right now. So it's kind of like other apps like Tweakbox or App Valley or Coconut X. So I'm going to show you how to download it right now. So first you're going to press Safari and then type in the search bar Panda Helper VIP like I'm doing right now. Then you're going to press go. Next guys you're going to press the first one that says Panda Helper get free mods and cheats and hacked games for Android. Even though it says Android, it still works for iOS. So you're going to press the first one. Next, guys, you're going to get to this page. And what you're going to do now is you're going to press regular. Because the, because the VIP version costs money. So you're going to press regular to get the free version. Once you get to this page, you're going to scroll down and then press download free version. Now, once this pops up, you're going to wait until it says... Um, that it wants to install a Panda Helper free 1.1.0, so you're gonna press install. Go back to the home screen, and, and as you and, and oh, sorry guys, I can't speak. Anyway, as you can see, it is now downloading. So we're gonna wait until it's done downloading. Alright guys, now that it's done installing, you're not going to open it just yet. You're going to go back into Safari, and then once you're on this page again, where it says the important notice and stuff, you're going to scroll down, and then it's going to say, click on trust. There is two ways, because guys, if, if you press it and then it says untrusted enterprise developer, you're going to press Safari, and the first way to do it is to scroll down here, and then press click to trust. And then it's going to say it's going to try to download a profile. You're going to press allow. It's going to bring you to profiles and device management. And then somewhere here it will show a profile with pad helper. So it should show one of these. As you can see. And you're just going to press trust. Uh, but since I already did it, um, it, it, I don't need to do it again. So just press trust when you get over here. The second way to do it is to close out of this thing and then scroll down and then press Untrusted Enterprise Developer Solution Tutorial. Once you get here, you're going to press Click to Trust once again. Well, I mean, not once again, but this is just the second way to do it. So it's going to say it's going to download a profile, you're going to press Allow, it's going to bring you back here. And then it's going to show you a profile with Pineapple in it, as you can see. Well, the one that I downloaded is this one here. But it may be different for you guys. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, once, you, once it, it's trusted, you're going to open the app. So it's just loading. Uh, I'm going to press don't allow for no notifications. Next, you're going to just keep on scrolling right and then press open now. So guys, we're in now. Oh, guys, there's an ad. There's ads, but if you turn off the internet... Well, what am I saying? If you turn, the, if you turn off the internet, you, you can't even use this. So just don't turn off the internet when you're trying to download stuff from here. So guys, once you're here, you're going to press the home screen twice. And then you're just going to swipe on Panda Helper. Just get rid of everything, and then reopen it. Alright guys, when this comes up, it says Fix Pen Helper. So when it crashes, or it gets, like, revoked, or... Actually, no. So if it gets revoked, you, you can't use this. 
But when um but when Tiny Opera crashes and it says that like it's it can't uh, verify, I'm pretty sure. Or okay, when it just crashes, you're gonna use this to re-download it and install. So you're gonna press click to install. It's gonna say the in installation guide. It's gonna say download profile and open Safari. You're gonna press download profile. It's gonna bring you here, and then you're gonna press allow. Next, you're gonna scroll to the settings, and there are uh, two ways to download the profile, or to okay, there are, there are two ways to to get to the profile download. The first way is when you're on settings, uh, it'll say profile downloaded. You're gonna just press that, and then it's gonna show this. The second way to do it, sorry guys, the second way to do it is to scroll down and then press general. Scroll down again and press Profiles and Device Management. And then it'll say here, Fix Pad Helper. But once you get to this point, you're going to press Install. And then press Install again. Done. Next, the Pad Helper fix will be right here. And then you can go here into Pad Helper. And you can download the game. So, you're almost going to search a game. Let's see, what should I search? Let's just search Minecraft. Oh, Twitter. Nope. So guys, some free apps are like are repairing, but like some apps are fine. Like Geometry Dash I think is fine. Uh let me try YouTube. Plus plus. Yeah, so guys, it will it like it will get fixed. Like you can download stuff still. Some apps you can. Like I did do this, and most of the apps said that it was um it still needed to be fixed. But guys, I did download Geometry Ash from that thing when most of the apps said that. So guys, this is basically it. It does work. So, so like, subscribe, turn on notifications, and leave a comment today, guys. So, um, bye guys, and see you in the next video.